let's talk about the wedding party. When you got the script at first, what went through your mind? I just had to connect to my childhood because like they just needed me to be the pastor that can pray fire. And I grew up in CAC, so it wasn't hard for me at all, man. Honestly, I'm actually really looking forward to seeing it because the quality, I'm all about quality and, you know, good content. And from how the fact that the trailer is funny and the quality is on point, even down to the costumes, they're so on point. I, I think, I think I'm, I'm, it's going to be the best. Our version of the Greek wedding party. That's what it is. And, and I'm glad it has lived up to every hype every of my imagination i'm really happy that i'm a part of this project when i got the script for the wedding party i remember reading it and i remember laughing so much i was like this is a nigerian wedding anything that could possibly go wrong all right happened in this wedding and what the wedding party is able to do is capture the nigerian spirit and it's very unpretentious about it. We're not trying to sugarcoat anything for you. We're not trying to preach to you either. We're just throwing you in the deep end and giving you a movie that's feel good, a movie that'll make you laugh, a movie that'll make you feel lighthearted when you come out at the end of it. And I'm just really blessed and really proud to have been a part of this project. From what I've seen, it looks very good. And um, I'm looking forward to seeing the full movie. I'm sure after I've seen it here, I'll just I'll take my family uh, to, go, to go and see it in the cinema. You know, yeah. Anything I see will be tinged with a measure of bias because my wife is in the movie. I think it's the best movie ever this year. See, people, people think that, yeah, Ikechuku, you're a superstar, you make music, yeah, yeah, yeah. so they sent you the script and they said, if you like it, come and do. It didn't work like that. I had to audition for this movie. Everybody had to audition. Well, maybe not everybody, sir. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but a lot of us had to audition for this movie. And, um, you know, I was just, I'm just thankful that I actually got, you know, selected for it. I want to see Ritty Doyle. I really love her. Yeah, yeah. It was a very funny script. So I laughed and I was ready to do something funny. I was ready to be in a comedy. You know Nigerians are big on weddings. Then now you now take a wedding and then you, you put together this, this ensemble cast that has major names and then you now have producers like Ink Blood, Ebony Life, Koga, Omo. It's going to be massive. I thought it was a very well written script. I thought it was funny. Um, I thought that it, it had, um, you know, a message in terms of just the fun and the, and the storytelling and the drama and, and love and redemption and all of those things um, I thought were, were present in the script. So I was excited to be a part of it. I think the one thing that they did phenomenally well, well, they did a lot of things well, but one of the things that they did phenomenally well was the casting of the film. Everybody from RMD and Iretzi Doyle to Shola Shobowale and Ali Baba to all the younger people, they, they just did an amazing job bringing this, this um, powerful cast together. This time last year we released a film for Moa Abudu called 50. It was such a great experience, she was a great client to have, you know. Everything went well, we became friends and she said, look Moses, I want to do another film. Um, I have this concept of a wedding party, but man, 50 has taken a lot out of me. Do you think I will be able to do it together? So we, we, we kind of explored it. We thought, you know what, it's bigger than both of us, you know, film one. And so I said, I, I know two wonderful production companies, you know, Koga Studios and Inkblot, who I think will fit very well, not only because they have the financial clout, but because that they, they have the kind of mentality and, 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 and spirit of collaboration that we were trying to get. And fast forward, you know, a few weeks afterwards, I pitched the whole story idea to them. We had a meeting with Mo, and the, the Ofike was born. And look, when, when something is supposed to happen, you know, everything just fits in, despite the challenges. And, and we've had a set, fair few setbacks, you know, real big ones, but everything fit into place from getting the cast buy-in to working on the script to getting the crew to getting selected at TIFF, getting selected in South Africa, getting selected and almost getting a release in Dubai and possibly the UK. It's just, it's just shown that it's one of those projects that was meant to be.
for the family table. This is for the bride. This is wrong. All right, this is, that's better. Get off here, it's not what it is! Oh, God. Don't hate the player, just hate the game. Well, this player is getting married today. Son of Lady Obianuju Ounka. That is correct. Dr. Tata with the Carpaccio option for starters. <coughs> I'm not about to let the cocos poison my guests. Where's Oladuni Coca? This girl, you are not jealous. Hi! We should have even charged them double bright price. Oh, oh my gosh. Have fun for me, brothers. I need a new best man. Fine, Shola, you are now the best man. Please don't make me regret this. What is wrong with you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, we we have it. Have it. Yes, Please tell me that didn't just happen. Uh, it's not that bad. Harrison, let's go. Abi, I should call my tailor. Get out of here! Madam. Have you called in her phone? She's not picking. Her phone's with me, ma. Calm down, calm down. Well, my daughter has been kidnapped. You don't need to calm down. The only person who has been kidnapped here today is my son. By that useless daughter of yours. Amy! Hey, uh hey! -huh. You should have asked for him if he tells Why is she going in for? Because we are the only cause. The bride's family. Dance is first. What about if we just don't sing together? Yeah, yeah. I don't tell you, say I be thief. I no be robber. Okay, thief, robber, please. What's the difference? Oh, you think this is a joke? Please, please. Uh, I'm sure my boss didn't mean any harm. <laughs> the boss didn't mean any harm. I, I, like I said, I'm not a member of their family. How does a man stay with one woman for the rest of his life? Poor Tony, so inexperienced. Just in case you're confused, this is where it goes in. <laughs> you need to do the fun and spontaneous things to and for him. I understand that you may not like Duni, but you need to understand that I love her, and that is never going to change. I have never needed anyone in my life the way that I need you. Are you gonna be my love Every person plotting evil against their marriage. No mercy. Die by fire. Hey, hey.